As support for Gaza goes mainstream, don't let the empire co-opt the movement. Opposition to the slaughter in Gaza appears to be getting more mainstream, which is obviously great. But when political impulses go mainstream, it means there's going to be a massive and concerted effort to funnel public sentiment in a direction that doesn't damage the interests of the empire. They're going to try to blame this all on Netanyahu. They're going to insist that Israel itself is fine, and the only thing that went wrong was a fluke incident in which an aberrational right-wing faction briefly got into power. They're going to try to wash the Western Empire's hands of the mass atrocities it directly facilitated in Gaza. They're going to try to frame Biden as a basically decent politician who found himself trapped in an impossible situation. They're going to keep pretending a two-state solution is right around the corner and doing everything they can to stall out meaningful change in Palestinian rights while blaming any obstacles to peace on the Palestinian resistance. They're going to pollute the information ecosystem with a deluge of messaging which is all designed to counter the notion that Gaza means the entire status quo needs to be overhauled with regard to Israel-Palestine, with regard to U.S. foreign policy, with regard to the U.S. government itself, and with regard to the Western power structure in general. They're going to say everything they need to say to ensure that everyone understands that the basic status quo in Israel, the United States, and the Western world is working perfectly fine. And this was all just an innocent little oopsie-poopsie caused by a few bad apples. They'll justify, they'll excuse, they'll exonerate, and then they'll distract. Moving public attention on to the next big thing, and allowing the amnesia of the daily news churn to wash Gaza from our attention, all while pretending to be on our side. This messaging will need to be fought tooth and claw. We cannot allow them to neuter this political moment with spin and propaganda. We need to make sure their criminality remains front and center of public awareness, and we need to push for the real revolutionary changes that Gaza plainly proves are needed. Let mainstream sentiment turn against the current Israeli regime and bring an end to the butchery in Gaza. But don't let the imperial narrative managers co-opt anything. Don't let them hijack the zeitgeist that's been building. View all words and actions of the Western political media class with aggressive skepticism. And push back forcefully every time they try to push public sentiment in a direction that advantages the empire.